Hi, my name is Brianne Miller and we're opening Canada's first 100% package-free grocery store. I'm 28 years old and we're on a mission to tackle plastic pollution and food waste within the grocery industry. It is a grocery store without any packaging at all. Um, everything will be sold in bulk and the idea is to try and reduce plastic pollution. We're working with consumers, convincing them to bring in their own containers to refill with food and then also working on the supplier side of things and starting to create change um, further up the supply chain. You know, 100 years ago, it's how our grandparents shopped. Uh, the idea is that you would bring in your own container, so it could be a Tupperware, it could be a Ziploc bag that you've used 10 times, it could be a mason jar, and you'll come into the store and we'll have a weighing station where you weigh your containers at the front, and we'll have a system that spits out a reusable barcode that you affix to the bottom, it has the weight encoded in it, and then you'll go throughout the store, you'll fill up your containers, and then when you check out, the weight of that container is automatically deducted. So it's quite simple. I mean, we hope that this is the, the grocery store of the future. Um, one that is on a mission to solve a lot of our social and environmental problems. I actually wanted to be an astronaut when I was a kid. Um, so I ended up studying the sciences in high school and then in university, just trying to keep those doors open. I ultimately ended up studying biology. But yeah, I ended up working as a marine biologist, so I did a master's degree overseas in the UK and then ultimately ended up in Vancouver. I've been working as a marine biologist for almost a decade. I really started to see the impacts of plastic pollution on a lot of the species that I was studying and decided from a personal point of view that it was something I wanted to to do and actually come up with a tangible solution that was easy for people to follow and incorporate into their everyday lives. What advice do you have for someone like me? I don't really know what a career path looks like. I don't know what I want to do. Yeah. I think I would say to, to do something that you love. You're really only going to be happy doing something that you love. I think when I was younger, I just had absolutely no idea about the number of jobs that were out there. If you don't find something that you like, you can always create it yourself.